Hello everyone, in this video, I couldn't find Jihoon in his room, so he quickly went to the rooftop of the hospital where he eventually found Jihoon. However, Jihoon told Jihoon not to come closer to him and insisted that Jihoon should go away and let him die because she believed he no longer had a reason to live. Jihoon tried to stop Jihoon and asked him to think about his family, but for Jihoon, he felt that he no longer had a family. In a situation like this, Jihoon couldn't be careless. He spoke slowly to Jihoon and asked him to consider who would be the saddest person if Jihoon died. Would it be Jaeguk? Jihoon explained that Jihoon definitely knew how Jaeguk was and although Jaeguk might be sad for a while, he would eventually forget about it, just like Johan. But Jihoon as a poor man would be remembered as the son who was the victim of an accident caused by his own father. Jihoon would also be remembered as the heartless man who killed Song Yi. Someone who meant everything to his her father in a hit and run accident. Jihoon would be remembered as a jerk, and eventually he might be forgotten or even accused of being an unpleasant memory for people. According to Johan, Jihoon's life no longer belonged to him after what he did to Song Yi. Jihoon had lost the right to choose his own death. Johan told Jihoon to stay alive and pay for his sins. While talking to Jihoon, Yohan slowly stepped closer to him and pulled him into his arm. Okay everyone, that's the scene for this time and thank you for watching my video.